Okay, here we have a really lovely Tiger GT Pro 1200. Um, real bargains, these are uh, the ones we've got. We've got three, uh, an Explorer and a couple of GT Pros, one with full luggage, this one with one box. Um, I think about 18 grand new. Now we're, this one I think is 10 grand, I think. So I would say quite a bargain for what you're getting. Uh, easily as good as the GSs if not better, nicer ride I think, but that's personal preference. It's a nice tidy bike. Um, it's got the engine bars there. Uh, the GT Pros have the lowering suspension, so it's got an electric lowering suspension thing, brings it down a couple of inches. Uh, fog lights. Nice high spec bike. This has got adjustable ABS, electronic suspension, cruise control, um, hand guards with little extenders on them. Um, we mentioned in the advert, it's got a tiny little mark which I'm showing you just there. So, really, you have to be looking for it to see it. I'll show you from all angles. So just a little scuff, just there. Front tire's good, slow to tread on that. Down pipes are fine. Centre stand looks nice and clean. The um, side stand, big foot. Tread on the rear tyre as well. Let's see that. Twenty-two ridge. It's got the genuine Triumph big top box. A couple of lids in there. Um, fog lights, daytime riding lights, cruise control, uh, it's got heated grips fitted there, there might be an extra on these. It's a nice big TFT screen. Um, it's got ABS, and you've got these riding aids, uh, electric damping, coolant warning, service, service settings, which I think tells us what the mileage is. All below me, we saw this. Alright, there's quite a lot of stuff to scroll through there. How do we get onto that? Oh, okay, right. I think this will tell us the mileage. So it's 15,823 miles. It doesn't need servicing for another 5,000 miles. Uh, you can connect your phone to it. Um, different damping settings. Oh, sport, normal, comfort. Uh, riding aids. ABS adjustable, so different settings for your ABS. Does have traction control as well. Different maps, different traction control, so different suspension, different ABS, different um, power maps, and different traction control, they're all adjustable. Yeah, let's get out of that. Some settings, riding mode, traction control, 
uh, quick shifter, hill start hold, yeah, you can have self cancelling indicators. So the riding modes there, and then you do have this feature on these. Remember how it works. Um, oh no, I've just turned it off. It's all right, I think. Let me just try this. It does have a feature that you can hold a button, I think it's the home button, and the suspension goes down. So if you're a smaller rider, you can have it with lower suspension, which is very, very handy. Uh, press and hold. Yeah, you see that little flashing white suspension button in the corner? That means the suspension's going down. You hear it working, and then that stays on showing you that it's in lower suspension mode. All right, just start it up. Starts nicely. Lower suspension. So that's normal suspension now. So engine sounds lovely, nice and smooth. This is service history. So, lovely high spec bike. Great sounding engine. Tiny little mark has pointed out. I would say, a bit of a bargain. <laughs>